everybody, Dr. Kristen here. So last time I spoke last week, I talked about uh, how important it is to make sure that you're drinking clean water. And today I wanna give all of you a lovely reminder to drink enough water. Because as much as I love all of you fantastic patients, you are not drinking enough water. And I have had to ask so many people recently how much water they're drinking. And I usually get the reply, oh, I definitely could be drinking more, I just forget. And so what I'm going to do is remind you that the vast majority of your body is made up of water. It is extremely important for getting toxins out of your body. And especially for all those youngins, I shouldn't even say youngins because adults are doing this too, myself included, are having some fun weekends where they are, let's say, drinking something that might be putting quite a few toxins into their body. So it's very important that you're drinking enough water to flush everything out. So how much water should everyone be drinking? So easy math. You take your body weight, let's say you weigh 120 pounds, you divide that by two and you're at 60 pounds. So that means that you need to be drinking 60 ounces of water a day. If you are drinking things that decrease the water in your body, like caffeine, um, you need to actually increase that amount even more. So how do you remember throughout the day to drink enough water? It's especially hard right now during the summer because people are just in their home and they'll fill up a glass of water here and there. Um, <clears throat> when they are out, they're out at a bunch of different locations at the day. The way that you need to, what you need to do, you really, really need to do this in order to get enough water is you need to buy yourself a really good water bottle and buy one that's significantly big. So that way, if you know to bring your water bottle around with you all the time, you, I promise you, you will drink more water. That was a game changer for me, even at home. Oftentimes, I'm filling up my water bottle instead of using my glasses because it's hard to keep track of how many glasses of water you've had. So why do I have these rubber bands up here? This is a great way to keep track of how much water you've had throughout the day. So I know that I need to fill this water bottle up three times and drink it in order to get enough water for me. So every time that I have one full thing of water, I take this rubber band and I put it down at the bottom. I should have three rubber bands on here, but I've hit the point where I don't necessarily need the reminder anymore. But now I know I've had one full bottle of water and I still need to fill it up again and drink another. It's a good reminder because sometimes you'll take a little peek and you'll see that you don't have a single rubber band down there. That means you need to start drinking up. So it's still summertime, it's getting warm again. Please do not be dehydrated. It's causing a lot of our patients to wake up with more pain in the morning because their body is just too dehydrated. You gotta make sure you're still hydrated before you go to sleep and um, get those toxins out of the body as well. So I hope this was a nice little reminder to drink more water and do some other healthy things while you're away from the office. Hope you all have a wonderful evening and I will see you next time.